OK, joined by Mick Bowen, Dublin Ladies Manager. Uh, Mick, a comprehensive victory over Meath this afternoon in the Leinster final. It's easy. Leinster champions once again. Congratulations. Uh, you a happy man after that? Ah, yeah, um, we are. Uh, uh, look, it's uh, obviously great. I, I was just saying it to our group in there. I was, many moons ago, I was involved for just for two years with the girls, 2002, 2003. And 2002 was the first Leinster senior title that Dublin won. Um, so the days will come where, again, where this won't be the norm. It'll, you know, there'll be a group will come, hopefully not during my time, but there'll be a group that will come that won't experience these days. So it's to try and just enjoy our successes because it's, it's easy to say, you know, it's just another whatever, Leicester Championship or whatever, but an awful lot of work goes into these days, you know. And realistically, even when me, the year they won the All-Ireland, we were Leinster champions, but... Like at the, at the end of the day, we would have looked back on that year not as a success. So we know there's bigger things to come. You had a healthy, obviously, first uh, half time lead. Um, so and I guess from the point of view of the game, it was almost won in that first half. You had, I think, a 12 point lead, maybe at half time. Uh, how do you feel the game went overall from the point of view of uh, your performance? Obviously, a comprehensive victory, but overall, the performance, how do you feel it went? Yeah, we were, we're probably disappointed. Um, in that we created uh, quite a number of chances and we, we didn't finish them. And that's disappointing. And we're setting our stall out on that. But that's, look, that's, uh, that's our own stuff and we'll go after that. And then I, I certainly feel on a different day that Mead would have punished us because we, we, were, we coughed up easy ball and down the central channel and they probably should have finished two or three good goal chances and they didn't. And all of a sudden the game takes a different perspective. Uh, from your season overall, how do you assess it? Because obviously you had a bit of a slow start in the league. You kind of built nicely during the league then, obviously into the Leinster Championship. And, uh, I guess culminating into today so far in, in, in the season. How do you feel the season's gone to, uh, gone to plan so far? Yeah, well, look, I mean, we, we did try and compete to get to the final of the National League. And uh, there was a time when I started off, the top four got into it. And that does make a big difference from the point of view that if you do have a slow start or you do lo lose your first National League game. And I would have said this, funny enough, to the association, I actually think it's a better system that you've top four involved in the National League. Because the National League is absolutely key to building your panel. Like when it comes to this time of year, there's very few games you're actually giving people a run unless they've shown something prior to this. So if you're trying to get into a National League final uh, and you're trying to use a squad, well, then it's very difficult to be successful. You can't any wobble and you find yourself out of the race. So that nearly forces you into playing your top team all the time, but that's not development. So we essentially take that approach that. Like what? What do we want at the end of the day? Do we want to try and create a squad for later down the down the line? And that's the way we've probably gone after it. Um, I, I think it's about three weeks or a month now until the start of the All Ireland series. So I'm sure plenty of celebrations today after today's uh, win. But you'll be uh, pretty much turning the focus and turn the page straight away. I'm sure on the uh, uh, on the Leinster Championship and on the the first half of the year and focusing on the All Ireland Championship over the next few weeks. Yeah, that's it, fully. Like, we give them a couple of days off and, you know, you have to enjoy it today. I, I, I was saying that inside, that if there was probably something I learned from all the years is that, you, you know, you need to really celebrate your victories because, uh, like, they come and go really quickly and then there'll be a day, as we all know, where they won't be there. So it's really important for them to go out with their, as a group and with their families and just celebrate today and its achievement and it's also a, a nice block of work that they've done and we'll take a couple of days off and then get back at it for the All-Ireland Series.